Thank you, Coach, for your very kind words. Wow, what an incredible honor to be joining such a talented group of athletes in the Taylor Athletic Hall of Fame. I'm extremely humbled and thankful for this opportunity and hope I'm able to convey my gratitude to the many individuals that played such a major role in my development as a person and athlete. I'd like to begin by thanking the Taylor Athletic Hall of Fame Committee for the selection and for the work you do to honor so many athletes. Thank you to Joyce Wood, I don't know where you went, um, for your work in communication behind the scenes to make this day such a great celebration. What a wonderful morning it has been. There you are, thank you. I love being back on this campus and having my mind flood with memories um, from my years as a student athlete. I had a similar feeling when I received the call that I was being inducted and my mind flooded with the many people who have so generously invested in my life. In all honesty, their names should be on the plaque with mine. I'm so grateful to have many members of my family, a lot of the little lo loud ones you heard were mine, um, here to celebrate with me today. Your support today and for the past several years means so much to me. My sister Kate was probably the biggest reason I began playing volleyball. She was a talented athlete and as my big sister, I wanted to be just like her. I still do. Here we go. <laughs> Thanks for the many hours you spent peppering with me in the yard as a kid and for sparking my love for volleyball. But I'm even more thankful for the example you are to me as a young mom, an example of incredible work ethic and selfless love. I'm an ugly crier, so I can't talk and cry at the same time. So I'm gonna compose myself here. I thought about trying to add up all the hours that my parents have spent traveling to and watching me play and coach volleyball but I realized that would take way, way, way too much time. Needless to say, their support, encouragement, and love is absolutely unmatched. I don't think they ever missed a game. One game, they said, one game. Dad, what a blessing it has been to grow up in the gym and watch you coach. The Lord has gifted you with an unbelievable ability to coach the game of basketball while impacting lives for Christ's kingdom. With coaching as my profession, it's my goal to emulate you, to be full of integrity, patience, and love, while empowering others to reach their potential as athletes and people. <clears throat> Mom, thank you for being my absolute biggest fan. You have shown me what it looks like to be loyal, have a servant's heart, and how to work hard, all things that were so important to my success as an athlete and will be even more important to my success as a wife and mother. I love you both so much. It was so fun to win conference championships, to go to nationals, and to receive league and national honors, but my biggest blessing at Taylor was meeting my husband, Colton, which I also kind of owe to TUVB because we, our first date was a pick a date. Um, he came to a volleyball game when, when we were freshmen, but didn't get the guts to ask me out until we were juniors. I was, I don't know, I was intimidating or something. <clears throat> Colton, thank you for supporting me and encouraging me to, be, to continue to pursue my passion of volleyball as a collegiate coach. You motivate me to be tough, to get better every day, and to genuinely love the people around me. You have sacrificed so much so that I can coach, and I'm incredibly grateful for the way you love me. I have to give a shout out to um, Coach Smith and Ashley, Coach Ashley Pritchard, um, on their recruiting efforts. Because for four years, literally four years, I was fortunate to play with the best teammates anyone could ask for. Yes, they were all very talented volleyball players and we won a lot of games, um, but they were even better people. And that's hard to recruit, a combination of those things um, for four years straight. I had no idea coming to college that I would have the opportunity to play alongside teammates who would become my best friends. <clears throat> and I see a lot of you back there. Thank you so much for being here. Um, the ones who stood by me on my wedding day and the ones I called when, I, when we were having our first baby. Kelsey, thank you for always being there for me for bringing perspective when I needed it, and for pushing me to reach my potential. My room sister, Hope, I was and still am so encouraged and challenged by the way you live out your faith and trust the Lord daily. One of my absolute favorite things is when we're all back together <clears throat> reminiscing about the glory days. I'm eternally grateful for the opportunity to play alongside the best teammates in the world. And to our trainer, Patience, you had a heart of gold. You held us together physically, but the way you cared for our hearts is incom incomparable. Coach Smith and Coach Ashley, I didn't understand then, but I certainly do now, and I want to thank you both for the way you poured everything you had into our team, for the way you pushed us to perform at our best, not, not for our own benefit, but so that we were glorifying God to the best of our ability. 
That lesson is one that I think of every single day. Coach Smith, thank you for seeing the potential in me as a little high schooler, for believing in me and for demanding excellence every day. I remember at my signing, you asked what some of my goals were. Did I want to go to nationals? Did I want to be an All-American? At that moment, something clicked in my head, and my dreams became a lot bigger than they had ever been before. The lessons I have learned through Taylor Volleyball and your leadership are too many to count. This program has shaped me and grown me into who God is calling me to be, and it's because of you, Coach, that I now have the opportunity to coach at Spring Arbor and pour into young women as you have done for me. It seems like just a few weeks ago, I was giving my senior speech at our volleyball banquet in the room right across the hall. I remember talking about God, how God had shown his faithfulness to me in a variety of ways um, throughout my time with Taylor Volleyball, through wonderful friendships and coaches, the opportunity to travel to Israel and Palestine, a successful career, and so much more. I have continued to experience the Lord's faithfulness in ways I never knew I would, in very hard times and very joyful times. <clears throat> For me, this induction will be a reminder of so much more than volleyball. It's a reminder of the gifts God has blessed me with, the people he's surrounded me with, and my responsibility to remain faithful to him as he has done so evidently for me. Thank you.